Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Joaquin Buckley versus Nur Sultan Rezabov. Uh, <clears throat> Joaquin Buckley 18 and 6, 3 and 2 in his last 5 fights. Minus 150 favorite, 30 years old a couple weeks ago. 5'10 with a 70, 76 inch reach. Nur Sultan uh, Rezabov, 34 wins, 8 losses, 2 draws. Pretty decent win streak at 10 wins in a row. Plus 120, near even, 30 years old. Fought just a little while ago, one month, four days ago, so about two months by the time they fight, at 185. So he's cutting down to 170, 6'5". He's going to have a, such a big reach. It's unbelievable, his reach, what it's going to be. Let's see if we can find it, Let's see if it says it. Uh, so, okay, so 76, 76. I thought it was more than that, but much taller, way less fight time for sure. Strikes landing per minute is 4.06 to 3.93. Small sample size says, of course, 34 to 43. He's very, very accurate. Absorbed is 3.26 to barely anything for Nur Sultan. Defense is 58 to 80% for Rizabayov. Takedowns 1.4 to 3.27. Accuracy is 36% to 100%. Takedown defense is 69 to 0 for uh, Nur Sultan. Now, again, he's only fought two times Bruno Vieira. And Cedric Dumas, only fights he's had. I don't know how Nur Sultan is going to make 170. Now, this was 185. Clear cut, Nur Sultan's winning this. Not even a fight. Because Buckley is so one-dimensional with his strikes. It's a very few straight punches. A lot of hooks. He throws that kick that we all know. Obviously, not the spinning back kick. But he throws a body kick. Throws a head kick. Buckley, a lot of pressure. I would pick Nur Sultan every day out of the week. If it was at 185, I don't know how. And under under two and a half months, on a short notice fight, he's going to lose 15 more pounds to make a weight class that he didn't fight. Has he ever fought at a uh, at, uh, welterweight? Let's, let's look real quick and see if he's ever fought at welterweight. Let's see. Okay, he has fought a welterweight before. Um, middleweight, 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 middleweight. Okay, so lightweight, he started his career. Welterweight, one, two, uh, da, 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 three, four, Five, five fights at welterweight, but he also had time to make it. Like he fought in March. Oh, hold on. He fought. Let's see. Mid okay, so middleweight, 2018, November 10th. He fought in middleweight, and then December 21st, so a month and 11 days later. He fought at Walter White. Did lose the decision, but, you know, still. Um, actually, let's see. So, Walter White, he won. 1-0. One oh. Let's see. Okay, 1-1. One one. Or 1-2. One 1-3. and, two. One and three. Won the welterweight title, so he's two and three. That's a super welterweight. That's one seventy-five. So I guess that's three and three. Okay, so he's three and three. I guess he's three and three. At uh... shoot. What's it's frustrating because there's not a clear cut, but he's not as good in the low, lower weight class. That's what I'm getting. So I like Rizabov. I think he could definitely win this matchup. I just don't know how he's gonna do at 170. I don't know. I, I he's fought a few times in his career. It's basically even. Maybe one up, one down. Not good. Unfortunately, I think Buckley wins this somehow. Joaquin Buckley. Yuck. As always, subscribe, like, comment. Peace.